Good evening. How is everyone doing? All had a good week? God is good? All the time God is good. Psalms 100 and verse 1 tells us, Make a joyful noise unto the Lord all ye lands. Serve the Lord with gladness. Come to his presence with singing. And that's exactly what we will be doing this evening. Praising our maker and our king through our voices and talents that God has given us. We are blessed and privileged to have a Shiva band all the way from Mumbai. We are blessed to see you guys here. We have been following you on YouTube. You have been a blessing to so many young people all across the globe. And we are blessed to have you in our midst. And I do hope and pray that the Spirit's intervention will be with us as we praise God with our voices and with our talents. To begin our evening service, shall we all bow our heads and ask God's Spirit to guide us with our worship. Let us pray. Merciful God, our Father, our Maker, and our King, we come to your presence this evening with our hearts filled with gratitude and thanksgiving, for thou art great and worthy of our praise. This evening, Lord, we come to you with our voices, with our talents, with our ability to praise you, to adore you, and to exalt your name on high. We pray for the Yeshua band and its crew, Lord, who have come all the way from Mumbai to bless us with gospel music. It is our prayer, Lord, may the Spirit's intervention be felt in our midst today, that the songs that are sung, the words spoken, the prayers offered, may be a source of comfort and inspiration for all of us. Empty we have come, Lord. Let us leave your house of worship, filled with your presence, filled with your prayer. Fill with your spirit and above all, Lord, with you in our hearts. Come and bless us one more time, for in Christ's name we pray. Amen. Amen. We welcome you, Lord Jesus, in this place. We welcome your presence here. Thank you. Thank you. 
Okay, how many have read the Bible that says, make a joyful noise unto the Lord? Can I say something? Wow. So, this evening, you know, it's not about songs, it's not about music, it's not about what we do on stage, but it's what Jesus has already done in our lives. Amen. He has already set us free. He's already healed us. You know, the Bible says by His stripes we are going to be healed. What does it say? Did I hear already? Does that what, is that what your Bible says? That by His stripes we are already healed? We are healed? That means we, all we have to do is just claim that healing. We have already been set free. Let us just claim that freedom. Amen. This evening, we just want you to know that we've come from different backgrounds. We've come from different parts of the world. But praise God. We worship one God, one King. His name is... Come on, you can do it better. His name is... His name is... So we want to continue worshiping Him. You can feel free to sit down. You want to stand. You want to worship. You want to clap. No problem. Where the Spirit of the Lord is, there is freedom. But before, before we go into uh, worship, I'd like to invite my uh, wife on stage, Jenny. And uh, she's, she has something small to share with all of you. And we believe that God is going to do something new this evening. Amen. Wow, it's great to be here. Welcome. Thank you all for coming this evening. Are you happy to be here? Yes? Amen. We are too. We are really excited to be here. We were in Silver Spring um, two years ago, 2017, Cameron and I, uh, for the first time. And we enjoyed it so much that we decided to come back. And it's been a blessing to be here. We've been having a wonderful time. I'm not going to take a lot of your time, but I quickly want to share a little bit about, well, about us about what we do, where we're from. But first, let me ask you a question because maybe I don't need to share anything at all. How many of you before this evening had heard about Yeshua Ministries or had heard one of the songs that we sang this evening? Can I see your hands? Wow, that's quite a few. Great, great. So I can keep it short, that's good. Um, so we are Yeshua Ministries, we came from Mumbai. I know I don't look like it, but I did come from India, um, and um, we have been ministering to people who speak Hindi, who sing and worship in Hindi, in congregations, mostly in India, but, but basically all over the world, for the last 16 years. And about 16 years ago, this ministry started, was started by Cameron, when he had almost like a pain, like almost like a frustration in his heart. He's a pastor's son, his dad pastors a small church in Mumbai, and he would see his friends in church being attracted to Bollywood music, you know, good quality music, catchy beats, um, relevant lyrics, and they would be attracted to it. And at the same time, he saw worship bands like Hillsong and, you know, these kind of Bethel and, and other churches come up with awesome English worship songs that were so cool and so attractive to youngsters. But there was nothing for the Hindi-speaking younger generation. There just wasn't anything. And they would be singing the same old hymns in church, not because his parents were against bringing, you know, modern instruments into the church, but there just weren't any songs. There just weren't songs to be sung in Hindi. And so he cried out to God, he said, God, we have to do something about it. Why isn't there something for me, for my friends, for our youth? Why are they leaving church? Because they find it, you know, irrelevant or they, or they can't relate to it. And so God told him, if you want to do something about it, you do it. You start writing. And as a, as a good Christian boy, he said, no thanks. You got the right, you got the wrong guy for the job. I'm not a singer, I'm, I'm only, I play the keys, but I'm, you know, in the back. His mom was the worship leader. Like, I'm not made to be in the front. 
But that voice kept coming back to him. And so one day his dad said, the next time you hear that voice, you know, God speaking to you, you'd be like Samuel and say, okay, yes, Lord, your servant is listening. And so it happened that Gavin started writing songs. And these songs, like the songs that we sang on Gaia Hosanna, Yeshu Kirana, these songs were meant to be for his church or his dad's church for their youngsters. They were never meant to, you know, go all around the world. They were meant to bless the local church. And what happened is one day they recorded those songs on a cassette. Some of you might still know what that is. And you know those cassettes, the awesome thing about it is that you can copy it over and over and over and over again. And that's what people started doing. And those cassettes were spread all over India, all over the world. And people had heard these songs before they had even heard of who's Yeshua Ministries or who's Karen Mendes. And these songs became a blessing to many. And one thing led to another, and Cameron started traveling with the band, and it started growing, and they were writing more songs. But the heart of the ministry is still the same. Our desire is still to bless the local church, to bless Hindi-speaking worshipers all over the world with songs in their heart's language. Our desire is still to do something relevant for the youngsters in India who have so many temptations around them, but to give them something that they can relate to, that they can reach out to. And today we travel a lot, um, we make a lot of new songs, and we love doing that, we love being a blessing. And a couple of years ago, God challenged us, why don't you make your music available for free? You're like, you know, Lord, kind of the way it works is that, um, you know, we make music, you sell it so you can make more music. And God was like, really, that's how it works? Well, not in my kingdom. And so we're like, yes, that's true. If you're going to want us to sell it, to give it for free, we're going to trust you. And ever since we did that, we made our music available for free. All our songs can be downloaded from our website. Um, they are also on iTunes and Spotify and other places where you have to pay for them. That's like not in our hands. We can't change that. But um, you can get it for free on our website and you can share it as much as you like. Send it on whatever, WhatsApp, Facebook, email. Send it to people as much as you like. Um, these songs started as a blessing through piracy on cassettes. Today we still pirate them on digital downloads. And we keep doing it. And we trusted God. We, we, we took, you know, a leap of faith. And uh, ever since we've done that, the ministry has grown, more doors have opened, we've traveled more than ever before. Where's, where's and the testimonies we receive are amazing. People, you know, coming closer to God, coming back to church, receiving healing, inner healing. Um, people from other religions coming to Christ because the music speaks to their hearts. And that is what we do, that's what we want to continue doing. And um, what you can be a part of if you like. So, yeah, please do go to our website, yeshuaministries.com, download the music, and send it to people whom you know who might be blessed by it. And another thing that I quickly want to share is that there's another ministry in Mumbai that we support called Bonam. And that is a social enterprise. We strongly believe in not only, um, you know, believing but also doing what you believe, like, you know, doing your deeds, acting it out. And so there's a social enterprise that Cameron and I run. It's called Bona, and it helps girls who are marginalized by society because of trauma, because of, um, you know, stigma, because of abuse, exploitation, trafficking. And our desire is to employ them, to help them raise above their circumstances, to give them a good, honest employment and these girls they make products um, and we brought some of those products with us so if you would like to partner with us in that work there's going to be a table outside that you can uh, leave your donation and uh, for every donation of uh, $50 and above you'll receive a product that has been made by the girl they're, they're um, toiletry bags they're really pretty they're really useful so yeah, that's what we want to leave with you this evening. 
consider partnering with us in the music by spreading the music to people who will be blessed by it and consider partnering with us helping these girls to you know build a better future for them um, and that's it I'm going to give it back to Cameron and we're going to continue worshiping this evening thank you so much back to the band. I want, as you have heard, the testimony of the crew, their ministry. At this time, we want to appeal to you to contribute towards that ministry. All of the offering that is collected this evening will be shared with them. Um, we have our ministries here and we are excited to be able to have them here worshiping with us. And we hope that we can support them in any which way we can there will be deacons on hand to collect our offerings this evening.
Yeshua Band for the great music they have blessed the whole world. How do we thank them? We thank God. We praise God. We lift His name even higher. Right? We follow Him and we obey Him so that His salvation can be completed and we all can go home. So that there can be no more tears, no more crying, no more pain. Amen? We would like to thank on behalf of Hopeside Church, my name is Anand Chavakula, and on behalf of Hopeside Church, I would like to thank uh, the Yeshua Band 
and uh, Cameron Mendes for blessing us tonight with such great inspiring music. I wish you came a little earlier, those who have come a little bit late. There was truly great music, joyful music that was presented. I wish we can go on, but sadly we have to part ways because of we just started, right? But you know, things are not in our control. So we would like to thank the Yeshua Band and our, our camera mentors for blessing us, blessing the whole world with such great music. I would like to ask Brother Camera Mendes to come forward. We have a small token of appreciation from our church. And I would like to ask Sister Mary Nowlangi to come forward and uh, give some gifts that we have for them. Show our clap hands with the And uh, she has some more gifts to the other members of the band. Not all of them could be here for whatever other uh, difficulties that came along the way, but we thank all of them for being here and blessing us at the start of this Saturday with some great, great music. We can go home with. <laughs> now these two other musicians, they are very well known and they play in very big churches. They are both technically and musically at the top of their skill or game or whatever you want to call it. So once again, clap hands for these two who are filled in for our musicians. And now I would like to take this opportunity to thank the Southern Asian Church. If you want to know more about the Southern Asian Adventist Church, please go to sastat.org. This is the beautiful church that they were able to give to us this Friday for uh, Yeshua Band to perform. So I would like to call Anu forward here to come off the stage. Where is Anu? Anu is the one who made it possible for us to have this concert on this Friday. Originally, it was supposed to be on some other day, and uh, but she made it possible for it to happen today. And also, I'd like to thank her and the church leadership, of course, and uh, Pastor Noy there, who's at the camera there for making this beautiful decoration. Can we all clap hands for them, please? So we have something for Sazbeck, Southern Asian Church. Uh, I don't see anyone coming here, but we'll give to Pastor John Daniel when he comes uh, at the close. And the next entity, the church that I want to thank is the Hope International Christian Fellowship that meets in Silverstone. And I would like to call Pastor Matthew Simon, you should get to know him. I heard him speaking. I heard his uh, uh, messages. So powerful, so inspiring. And I would like to thank the Hope International Community, I mean, International Fellowship, Christian Fellowship, for making it possible for me to get to know them. I know them, I, I came to know them about six or seven years ago. In fact, they performed at our church on our first anniversary. And so ever since then, uh, I had some great uh, acquaintance with them. And, I, I was truly blessed to know them in many different settings. So, uh, uh, the Yeshua band will perform tomorrow at his church, which means uh, at a certain address which he will tell, and uh, you'll also get to know about that address uh, uh, in, in the lobby area. So tomorrow at 5 p.m., uh, at the address that he will say, uh, you can watch Brother uh, Cameron Mendes and his band, Yeshua Band, performed there as well. And I would like to ask Sister Mary to come and, as a token of our appreciation, give something from Hope Side to Hope International Christian Fellowship Church. And so I would like to ask Pastor Matthew Simon to give more details about tomorrow's performance. Thank you, Brother Alan. How many of you enjoyed today's worship session? Praise God. Tomorrow, 6 p.m., the Yeshua Band will be performing at Briggs Cheney Middle School. 
and all are welcome. If you wanted your friends and family to come and they were not here, bring them along tomorrow. All are welcome to come. God bless you. God bless SASDAQ and the leadership here in the days to come. What great harvest he will do here and through this ministry and through Yeshua Ben. God bless you. And now I would like to request uh, Pastor John Daniel, who will close us out. And uh, wish us all good night, happy weekend, happy Sabbath, anything you can think of. But uh, thank you all again for coming. You all uh, have been blessing this concert by your presence here. So thank you again. So let's all clap hands for one another. Thank you. Uh, that we all were able to worship in unity and through music, though we are from many different denominations or uh, our backgrounds. So thank you all again from me to all of you. Shall we all stand as we seek the Lord in prayer? Let's pray. Gracious God, our Father, we are grateful for everything that you've done for us. As we began this evening by reminding ourselves there is one name above all name, Jesus Christ the Lord. No one, Lord, can enter into the kingdom of heaven except through you. For you promised us, I am the way, the truth, and life. If anyone is in me, he will have life, life abundant, life eternal. We thank you, Lord, for the good news of salvation that has enabled each of us to be set free. This evening, Lord, we thank you for music. Your ministry, Lord, has been known to everyone through the language of music. We thank you, Lord, for members of Yeshua band and ministry who have come here all the way from Mumbai to minister to us. As they go around across the globe, singing, ministering through your word and praying for people, may you bless their talents and may they continue to, Lord, reap a great harvest for your kingdom. We also pray for the ones who have come this evening hoping that somehow they will receive comfort and guidance and encouragement through your word and through singing. Bless us, O oh Father. We know that your coming is very soon. When you come in the clouds of heaven, if it is your will, grant us a place in your eternal kingdom. For all these mercies we plead and pray in Jesus' holy and righteous name. Amen. Thank you all for being here. It's such a joy to have Ishua band members with us. I do hope and pray that God's richest blessings will be with all of us and especially with you as you minister for his name. God bless us all. Thank you. There's one more person I uh, forgot to thank. Brother Moses Chavan here who did the sound program is equipment here. We were truly blessed by the sound that he uh, was able to enjoy. Thank you, Moses Chavan. And whoever does you know, and his helpers too. And all those who have always uh, been here and helped and, and, and in the AV room as well. And also uh, all those who are in the back supporting us. Amen. Good night.